my baby hair level is still up and do them baby hairs. <laughs> so who's ready to give sleep babe with me for the winter? Like a sleep bun just does something to an outfit in the wintertime. Like, just look at that. <laughs> my channel if you are new here hey come on and subscribe to join the fam and take off with me as we go on this journey of diy hair ourselves like this hairstyle that i'm going to be doing in this video it will be a sleek bun i'm thinking about messy baby hairs but then again i don't know if i just want the sleek look to go you know from start to finish just about to blow dry my hair very quickly um on a low setting use heat protectant if you're using heat thank you <laughs> so I'm gonna do that and I'll be right back to you guys. So my hair is all blow dried out. Um, like I said, I prefer to work on stretched hair, blow dried hair, because it's easier for me to kind of do a lot. Um, it defeats the purpose sometimes because I'm just gonna damp my hair a little bit. But when I want messy baby hairs, it is um, good to try to do like freshly washed hair because if I have to use heat, um, my hair is clean. Um, heat would be like a flat iron on low setting. Um, if I had some perm rods, I would also do messy baby hairs like that. Just putting my hair in the perm rods and just letting them sit. But if I'm doing messy baby hairs today, it will be with a flat iron. So this is what I'm working with. My hair has definitely grown a lot. Um, I was pulling out some strands because I definitely need a trim. Um, but I'm gonna try to wait until I let professional do it. I do at home trim sometime myself, but I know it's time for me to get like an inch taken off. So I'm just gonna leave it alone. The main product, <laughs> Eco Style Gel. Some people like to use conditioner when they're doing their sleek styles. I like Eco, um, it works very well on my hair. I normally combine it with my Camille Rose um, Honey Nectar Leave-In. <sighs> but I don't have her. I managed to go get her to seal it on top. That's normally what I like to finish with, but this is the main. Foam mousse leave-in conditioner for my ends of the actual ponytail that will be a bun. If I want it to last a long time, I'm gonna use some type of hoven spray on top just lightly to just finish the look. Um, if I want it to last me more than two days, use a hoven spray. And then the finisher. I love Garnier Fruities. This serum smells so good and it does so good on my hair, my weed, my bundles, the whole nine yards. I just love it. And it's at Walmart, it's very affordable. I think less than $3, I love it. One thing I like to do before I start, I like to put my hair where I'm gonna want my bun to be at. So I feel like I want this to be low, but not to my neck. <laughs> When I'm doing sleek styles, I really like to place um, my bun before I add product where I may want my bun to lay and it helps me kind of know how I need to mold my hair. So if we're going for the messy baby hairs look, you want to pull your baby hairs out before you start using product. So if I have too much, it's easy to just go back in and mold it down. But for now, I'm just gonna take this much out and it's better to have more than less because once you add product on the hairs that will be your edges or baby hairs, sometimes they're not as messy as you want them to be. This will be what I'll be using. If you guys see me looking under, I'm in my bathroom. So there's a mirror on the sink. Also gonna take out some back hairs. So for this next part, I will be using my Eco Style Gel to mow down my hair and get it slick. Slick, sleek, slicker sleek. Y'all know what I mean. 
play some music and let you guys just see what I do. I do like to add product on top of my hair. I do not go in between sections um, because this is freshly washed hair. I don't want all that product build up throughout, you know, my hair. So if your hair is thicker, yes, section it off and mold it down how you see fit. But I just like to add product on top and at the back and I'm good to go. So let's see that process. So now that that is all sleeked down, I am going to go in and do my baby hairs with this Kiss Ultra Slim Flat Iron. Um, I got it from Walmart, I think, Walmart. The heat protecting on these baby hairs and I got a little bit of gel right there so I know not to get that close because I'm not trying to sizzle my hair with some dang <laughs> gel. Current heat protectant is the Sleek It Iron Straightening Heat Protectant um, Heat Spray. Three day sleep up to 450 protection. Um, with baby hairs, I spray it in my hands and I just make sure to slide that on. This is more of like a mist, so I kind of try to wait um, just at least a minute or two before I actually put the flat iron to it because a mist is going to be kind of like a spray bottle mist. That's how it's going to feel on your hair. So I'm just going to kind of let that sit there for a second um and just you know let that not be totally misted <laughs> before i put the flat iron on it but y'all see how simple that was like i didn't use that much eco but that's what we're looking like so now i'm going to go in i like to split off and start with this section by my ear I try to do one pass and that'll do it. I'm gonna leave it just like that. And then I'm gonna split it off again. That's another one. And then last one on this side in the front. That is done, but let's try to mold some of them down. I can't find an edges brush right now, so I'm just gonna be taking this comb and just kind of manipulating the hair how I want it, right? And then I kind of see how it's going to lay. So now I'm just gonna go in with a little bit of that eco. And I'm gonna put it at the start of the baby hair. So I'm not going all the way down to what's fluffy. I'm just doing the start. And I'm gonna hold that there. And then repeat the same process on the other pieces. So I'm just gonna hold that there for a second. Go in with your holding spray. Pat it down. And that's what's gonna help to hold it in place right, so that is it <laughs> very quick very easy if you are a baby hair lover try some messy baby hairs with a sleek bun and give it a try and even if you wanted to do this and add a drip ready ponytail baby actually i'm gonna do that next time <laughs> <laughs> the products that I use will be down below in my description box while you're down there Please feel free to subscribe to my channel for more relatable content and click on the notification bell So you can be tuned in to all of my uploads because I'm about to come in hot for the winter <laughs> So thank you guys so much for watching and I hope to see you in my next one. Bye beauties